Welcome to this month's edition of the State of Friartown. I'm Nick Rojas, and joined alongside me, as he is every month, the Athletic Director here at Providence College, Mr. Bob Driscoll. How you doing, sir? Doing great, Nick. Great day to be a Friar. Big oh. East coming up, right? Absolutely. Big East coming up. You speak about that. The men's basketball team heading to New York City. Sir, how special is it to have the Big East tournament in a city like New York City, have it at a venue like Madison Square Garden, and everything that comes with Big East tournament week? Well, there's no greater city in the world than Manhattan. Uh, I was looking at the, uh, the news the other day, and it's the 35th anniversary of the Big East. Uh, it's the longest running uh, college basketball tournament in the country in one location. And, you know, it's the world's most famous uh, sports venue. So that's about as, as big as it gets. Absolutely. And, and certainly that everything comes with that week is, you know, we have donors and fans that head down there and they have special events like they do at PJ Clark's. It's just a fun environment. Well, I still have vivid memories when we won the Big East Championship in 2014 and going back to PJ Clark's, which is owned by a trustee, Tommy Boyan. And the energy in the city and the success we've had, the alumni come from all over the country, if not the world. So it's a really special place and um, I'm fired up. Absolutely. It's special to have like a little mini Providence inside a small place in, uh, in New York City. Well, the Friars are looking to make a run there. The men's basketball team, hockey's having success. Soccer has success. For someone like you that's been here as long as you have been, how does it feel for you personally to see that sustained level of success where now it's almost expected the teams perform as well as they do? Well, I hear what you're saying, Nick. I am old, so I've been here, <laughs> no, I've been been here like a long that. time. But, um, <laughs> It, it brings me great joy because it's a culmination of a vision and a dream I think all of us have had in Friartown to make us one of the model programs. And when you look at the job Nate has done, hopefully we'll get to a fourth NCAA tournament in a row, won a national championship, a hockey championship, and Ed, if we're fortunate enough to get by St. John's and uh, do some damage in the Big East, I think we got a chance to go to the fourth consecutive NCAA tournament there as well, which would be unprecedented um, but it's also soccer it's track it's it's women's hockey it's the programs have I think have arrived now our challenge is how do you sustain it absolutely well I look forward to doing this every month thank you for joining me thank you for your great work thank you go Friars go Friars